Hello guys, welcome back to All in Reality. And today we'll be looking into Euphoria image targets with uh, video placement. So you can do any kind of image you can take uh, your children's photo or your particular personal photos and convert this into a like augmented reality experience, which should be very much nice. So I'll just quickly show without code how we can do this with Ufor Engine 10.9. So you can go to download section of this uh, engine portal and from there you can take the updated package and you can import that. We will come back to that. I, uh, either you can register or log into this portal if you have already logged in. Once you log in, you will be seeing uh, license manager and target manager. License manager is for license key. That is the only thing we will be doing here. And target manager is basically uploading your images here with particular JPEG or PNG with width uh, one you can have normally and you can give the name and you can upload the image right once it is uploaded you will be able to see the particular rating and everything so if it is properly having the colors and everything it will be augmentable with video or any 3d object so you can add n number of uh, targets according to the free limit you have like i think thousand or something you can upload images and you should be getting at least four rating Otherwise, your augmentation will not be uh, stable. So you can see this points and everything, right? So this is how it will be looking like when it is trying to recognize. So once it is done, you can download this package and keep it ready for in importing into the Unity with uh, Unity Engine uh, support. So I have downloaded this package and let's get uh, dive into Unity and just kind of import uh, uh, this particular package, what we have downloaded for Vuforia 10.9. And even I have like already videos and everything added to my project so that we'll be quickly able to kind of augment this. So once that is done, you can convert into Android and you have to put some uh, play settings and everything according to Android uh, setup. IL to CPP because uh, new Android supports IL to CPP and uh, everything else same. You have to give uh, ARM64. So I'm importing this uh, Uphore package which we have downloaded already. And you have to put at least uh, 8, Android 8, because that is the uh, least one we'll be supporting with this uh, image target thing. Now you can kind of directly create the Ufora engine image target. So once you create this, you will be able to like import your image library, what we have downloaded, image target library. Yeah, from database we have to select. So you can uh, if you already imported your uh, package so you will be able to like see this images in the image target section yeah so you can see what is the target uh, database and you can select whatever the target you want to particularly augment the content on and uh, here we have default uh, euphoria behavior which is the event handler you can see all the particular uh, like events here and you can see found and lost and what is the tracking state. You can use these things but for now simply I'm just keeping it for found and lost. So I'm just uh, playing a video when it is found the image circuit and if it is lost I'm just uh, kind of pausing it. So that is the only thing we are using for. So you can take a plane and exactly augment on this. You can put any 3D object and uh, kind of uh, augment according to this image target and the size you are giving. And uh, once you have this image target uh, overlaid with the plane, so everything is fine. So you have to align it. I'm just taking a material and applying to this particular plane so that it look exactly the same. And from the first frame itself, the video will look like it is playing as a real world uh, video right so we have to just align it according to 180 degrees so i'm just uh, like doing it one to one and one, once that is done so we can add a video player on top of this and uh, from there we can uh, add the video what we have with our particular uh, library the video clip so we have to mainly in the video player we are not going to change much so I'm just dragging and dropping the video which we have and I'm just going to disable play on awake because I don't want this to be played on awake and uh, I don't want the I don't want to wait for the first frame also so you can disable those both because uh, we'll be having the video played on the particular found uh, event of image target so we can just play we can drag and drop the video player here 
and we can play and on a particular lost we can just uh, stop it either or we can pause this particular thing yeah so that would be enough so you can uh, i can quickly create one more image target as well so i'm just duplicating similar way and i'm just giving a different image to that particular thing so you can just uh, kind of uh, do how many images you want and you can like have multiple image targets so i'm just having a different video and uh, everything else is similar we just need to have the same uh, way uh, what we have for the player so we can have uh, n number of uh, images and you can do multiple image targets with this example as well going forward we'll even cover uh, with in code but we can just build it for now and we can see how this application turns out to be and before going to build right we need this license key from our developer portal which you have copied right so you can go to your application and you can try to copy that license key you can create a sample project in license manager and get the key this is free free of use and uh, we have to uncheck ar core usage otherwise it will require you to have ar core support on the mobile so you can just uncheck and you can leave it for uh, uh, optional that's it i think everything else is similar so let's uh, build this and test how it looks like in the application mobile app <laughs> till here and uh, i hope you like this video and uh, please do leave a like comment and subscribe to our channel thank you so much for the support and uh, i hope we will be hitting uh, 2k soon and uh, thank you so much for the support till here and uh, hope to see you in the next tutorial until then keep watching all in reality thank you so much